I didn't see this coming. Y'all ready? It's important to understand that supply and demand curves can shift based on external factors. A perfect example of this would be New York's real estate market during COVID. P1 represents what the average price of an apartment was in New York City prior to COVID. Then when COVID hit, the demand curve shift in. There was significantly less demand for rental units, so prices were lowered. At the same time, so many people were moving out of the city, supply shifted to the right. There was suddenly a huge increase in supply, so prices lowered even more. Exactly, so the more supply you have, the lower the price will go. The less supply that you have is scarce, rare. It's not many of it. The higher you can charge, especially when there's a demand for it. And this is why the housing crisis is a supply side issue. So objectively, in order to decrease rent, you need to increase the supply. And a big part of increasing the supply is to take away regulations that make it incredibly hard and incredibly expensive to build more inventory in the city. But that takes a lot of hard work to do. But instead of doing the hard work required to shift the supply curve to the right and decrease prices, what Mamdani plans to do is artificially cap the price with rent freeze